So you can compromise that safe with the makeup. Like maybe I, maybe a little bit more natural makeup. You definitely can compromise. But isn't that a, isn't that a form of support? He's supporting you in your natural state, right? But no, he's supporting oh. his vision. His vision of what she wants, not my vision. If my vision is to look like this and put makeup on, I want you to be like, damn, baby, that, that eyeliner is crisp. But, but, that, but you understand that's not you. What do you mean this isn't me? This is that's me. That's not you. How is this not me? There's a little natural. Bit of vision, a little there's bit of that. enhanced. That's natural is you. That's not you. That's, a, that's peacocking. No, so, this is me. What about a haircut? A haircut not you? No, that's, that's his natural hair. That's oh, like, no. Makeup is a filter. What you makeup mean? If he gets a haircut and a liner, that's not. Really? Yes, that is me. My, my no. hair is not me. <laughs> I'm not saying not to get your hair done. I'm saying not to put a whole nother face on your face. Yeah, not to put a face on your face. But this is peacocking. This is just part of evolution. Yeah, it is what it is. It has to be leading, but you can have a badass chick that's like still also like very powerful, and y'all come together and you have a powerful ass main character type of you no know, relationship, yeah. and that's awesome. But like most men, if the woman is leading more than the men, the shit is never gonna work, and everybody knows that. They know that, but they pretend like they don't know that because they want the power and they naturally want to separate the weak males from the strong ones. And if you happen to be weak, goodbye. And 60 pounds, would you break up with her? I give her 65. 70. 75. 100. 105. <laughs> so you're staying with her through Dude, thick and thin. Like as long as those titties are still pierced. <laughs> All right, what about him? Let's say That's he gained funny. 150 pounds. As long as his dick was working and thick, I'd be liking it. It's not going anywhere. I know, as long as his dick stuck <laughs> out, you know, I didn't have to like search through it. As long as I can see it over my toes. <laughs> a lot of uh, men will say, yeah, she got fat, whatever, blah, 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 I'll be staying with her. The woman, on the other hand, if she gains massive amounts of weight and you still down with that, she's not going to respect you just because if she doesn't respect herself, but you do, why would she then respect you? You know what I mean? Something your mom doesn't know about you. I lost my virginity on the football field in high school. How old? I was 13, 14. Uh, 14. Okay, what about you? This is something my mom doesn't know about me. That I got my nipples pierced. Who cares? Yeah, you can see them. You can see them. You can see them. All right, what about you? My mom knows everything about me. She doesn't know that I got this tattoo the other day. And then I'm HIV positive. I'm joking. And that I babe. Yourself on a scale of one to ten. A solid three, maybe three and a half. You think other people would agree? Uh, yes. What do you rate this girl on a scale of one to ten? Uh, I give her a solid uh, eight, eight, seven. Eight's a little hot. What do you rate yourself on a scale of one to ten? I'm like a solid seven. You think other people would agree? No, they're giving her a zero. What do you rate this guy on a scale of one to ten? Seven or an eight. What do you rate yourself on a scale of one to ten? Like a six or a seven. You think other people would agree? <laughs> I don't know. What do you guys rate this girl on a scale of 1 to 10? 6. 8. What do you guys rate yourselves on a scale of 1 to 10? 7. 6. You guys think other people would agree? Yeah. What do you rate these guys on a scale of 1 to 10? Uh, like 6. 6. What do you guys rate yourselves on a scale of 1 to 10? 7. 6. You think other people would agree? About 5. This is like they are paid to not say 10. But when you go on these podcasts uh, in Miami, right? With Fresh and Fit and whatever. All those women will say 10. Why? Because they are on a podcast, obviously. And second of all, they do have that inflated view of themselves, which is just ridiculous. But they play it anyway. They know it's not true inside them, but they still say it. <sighs> Six. Bro, that's crazy, bro. You was doing a mad pose that she still gave you a six, bro. Just can't win. <laughs> Do you know when, like, the hair's not long enough for the braids? Yeah, I'm coming for you next. <laughs> you know them struggle braids? Just for the struggle braids alone, you get a two. <laughs> struggle braids but then again every guy has his own style so i wouldn't say like oh my god how can you do that who cares
afford to go on a date with a girl that I should not go on. You have a date no at business all. asking her out yet. Right. It's embarrassing. <laughs> like, I'm not gonna ever make a girl pay for shit. I'm gonna pay for everything. I don't even care if you have millions of dollars. I'm still gonna pay for yeah. it because it's disrespectful in exactly. my mind. Like I wanna provide, I wanna take care of the girl. That's how it is. Yeah, but at the end of the day, you should be doing that for women that genuinely wanna be with you and for women that you have a connection with. Right. Yeah, you should be paying for it 100% of the time. You're the guy, you ask out, you go out there, you hunt, you provide. You're not going to ask someone out and then say, oh, but I don't have any money. Can you give me some money? Like, you're not going to get laid that way, honey, ever. But do it to women that actually want to meet you, not women that are there for a free meal. Women like acting out for videos. Never did it. Let me see you make in person. Oh, I'm making buzz on the floor. I'm gonna bust on you. Bust in my face. Oh. Oh. <laughs> bust out on me, boo. Ah, she knows she's on camera, but then again, she gets honest. You know, people tend to be a bit extra honest as a joking manner. Um, other than that, honey, I'll take your advice. Come over to England, London. Like, uh, find cake calling attractive sometimes. No, I don't. They she's lying. Say the right thing is that's the thing. They're gonna call you Senda or Javan, and I hate that. Me with my hair, it's always my hair, 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 and I'm like, that is not nice, honestly. Mm -mm, it's not attractive. I don't like it. No, but sometimes with I feel like body. the things that they call you out by are sometimes your insecurity, so already exactly. I'm very really turned off. Like, exactly. I'm insecure about my height, and you're gonna say, Shoti, my size, like. When you're gonna get older, you will lust for th these times when you were cat cold. Yeah, it's just the truth. Trust me, you're gonna look back and you're gonna be like, oh yeah, those were the good old days when I got a fat ass, some nice titties, and men were cat calling me from scaffolds and stuff. So uh, appreciate them anyway, because you're gonna miss those times. Do you ever see the hypocrisy in other women, or is it more of a you go girl moment? I feel like, yeah, I feel like it is a more you go girl moment. It's definitely a you go girl moment. It's more of a you go girl moment. It's probably two out of a thousand women probably see the hypocrisy there everybody else is oh you go girl full of shit yeah because at the end of the day it doesn't really matter what women say or do men if, if it's bad things men still want to sleep with them and they get a pass on so much stuff is it hard for some women to get along with other women competition attitude attitude Girls are greedy, envious, jealous, so... Women are fake. Women are just haters. Women can be bitches and catty and judgmental and judge you right off the bat. Yeah, same as people will. Um, but you see, women don't have that physical advantage towards men or towards other women for that regard. So obviously they have to compensate for that. So uh, they will find strength in just being bitches. <laughs> And I don't know, for some people that works, it is what it is. Slap. Slap. Ah! Alright, uh, your turn. No way, where are you going? You gotta slap me. Okay. Ready? <laughs> ah! You gotta do it harder. You gotta do it harder, 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 harder. Hey, follow. Well, if that girl slapped you harder, you would uh, eat hamburgers with Jesus in heaven. 